Good Thursday, y'all. What's up, guys? Ralph coming at you from the path. There's a little biplane circling around these fields. I don't know what he's looking for, but he keeps flying right overhead. Anyway, it is a crispy Thursday morning. It is minus 15 Celsius. That's 5 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, so it's a nice crisp morning for a walk. Still no deer. Hopefully one of these days. I mean, that'd be nice, but I'm still probably way too loud. Anyways, it's Therapy Thursdays, guys. Uh, hopefully we're gonna get into vision therapy. Lou wasn't feeling the best this morning, so hopefully with a little bit of rest, she'll be okay to drive me still. Otherwise, it'll be a quiet day at home. But, uh, yeah, I thought I would uh, just give you guys a quick little update. Um, I know I mentioned yesterday that we're, I can't remember if it was yesterday or the day before, that I haven't been vlogging the more boring aspects of my concussion recovery, and I thought maybe uh, on Therapy Thursdays I would just give you guys an update as far as like where I'm at um, with recovery and uh, what I'm still dealing with in hopes that it could potentially help somebody who is dealing with the same thing. We've had a couple people reach out uh, who are dealing with PCS, post-concussion syndrome, and uh, I think that it would be helpful, like in hindsight, it would have been helpful to have some, some insight from people who have been through the same thing. And I have since had some friends uh, chat with me and, and encourage me and that sort of thing. So, yeah. Anyways, today is uh, day 163 of concussion recovery. Uh, about five and a half months in, and uh, definitely feeling much better um, than even a couple months ago. Um, things are still kind of slow on the vision side, hence the vision therapy. I still have uh, basically like snow in my vision so it always kind of looks like it's snowing or, or misting out um, still have trouble with movements feels like objects move um, like instead of me moving if I shake my head like this it kind of looks like the trees move instead of myself so that's a little trippy and that makes me feel sick in the car especially um, still minor sensitivity to light and screens I can only spend about a half an hour in front of a screen before I start to get eye pain and headaches and start to feel a bit nauseous. Uh, that's getting a bit better and so is the motion. I think that has to do with the vision therapy and the, the uh, vestibular exercises that I've been doing, which basically involves me holding my thumb out and shaking my head side to side while looking at it. Um, yeah, so that's where I'm at now. Uh, still a little bit of fogginess. There's this interesting disconnected feeling uh, that you can get when you have a concussion and it's weird it's definitely been getting better but at times it can almost feel like you're half dead just kind of in limbo um, and that's actually a common symptom uh, and it can can cause some emotional distress um, the emotional side of things has uh, been pretty good lately but initially and I didn't really talk a ton about it but initially I did have a lot of issues with anxiety and depression and uh, it's still kind of in a while a lot of it is just the change in lifestyle too um, but those are kind of the stranger things that people don't talk about uh, when you have a concussion the emotional distress uh, and dependency uh, so yeah it's it's a bit of, it's a bit weird to talk about because I have felt like a bit of a child in this whole process just feeling like I'm somewhat emotionally dependent on Lou being around um, and that has gotten better, and uh, yeah. So, anyways, that is my update. I'm feeling better, getting there slowly, and uh, it's Therapy Thursday, so hopefully we can get some vision therapy today and keep things moving. Whew. 
I'm actually quite warm because I got fleecy pants on underneath. Okay, I'm gonna head home, see if Lou is feeling any better. See if we can't uh, go see the doctor. We are in the car headed to Vision Therapy for Therapy Thursdays, guys. Um, how are you feeling, Lou? Not too bad. Not too bad. Lou is feeling a little sick this morning, so hopefully this ride doesn't kill you. I'm doing okay. I didn't have coffee, so you know something's wrong. Yeah, there's definitely something up if Lou doesn't have her morning coffee with me. Is that where you do your therapy? With the barred windows? So I got another Tim's coffee. Someone asked if um, Tim's qualifies as sexy brew. No, it really doesn't. <laughs> I think I'm gonna head to the mall and just walk around for fun. This was my way out. Oh, this ball's too big. I don't know where I am. Found the way out. I actually didn't think about what I was going to say. <laughs> <laughs> How often does that happen? Hey! <laughs> <laughs> We're at a parking lot. Vision um, therapy is over. Yes. Freaking vision therapy. You had a good session? Yeah, it was alright. He has new exercises. He gets new exercises every week. So, no more dancing? So that sucks. Um, no more Randolph Shuffle. Um, you don't know what we're talking about. Check out, when was that vlog? I don't remember. It, it was yesterday, matter. two days ago. Dance, how to do a dance thing. How to do a dance, dancing no, exercises. No, now I have a stupid, just like, I have to take a look at a coin and go like this. Oh. <laughs> I was like, are you excited for them? He's like, no, I hate them. I hate all my exercises. <laughs> I'm so sick of them. I know, babe. But whatever. You only have 18 more weeks to go. No, 12. Oh, okay, good. And then we'll see if there's more needed. Film me playing dress up! Lou, <laughs> Lou found my mom's... Don't! <laughs> Lou found all of my mother's <clears throat> winter coats and hats and now she's trying them all on, so... Just, just ignore that, Mom. She was trying on your, your, whatever this is. <laughs> it's nice. I'm not. It's just funny. <laughs> All right, we're going for a walk. We're going for a walk. Oh my goodness. Well, I wonder about you all the time. Really? Yeah, I'm concerned for your well-being. I'm concerned about your well-being. Yeah, well, you should be. The difference is, I shouldn't be concerned about your well-being, but I am. Segway! Lou is watching Brit's Breakdown in the front. Back? Yeah. I guess that's the back. That's the front. That's the living room. Anyways, I realize that I have not really uh, vlogged the drum kit that Lou rented me for my birthday, uh, which was very kind. A little dark down here. So I thought I would show you guys. Um, it's been nice. She rented this lovely electronic kit for me for my birthday, and it's been great to just kind of hop on uh, every once in a while and play. Just get a little bit of a little bit of jamming in. I hook my speakers up here and I can play away. That's kind of fun. I am really enjoying it, not gonna lie. So anyway, I can get away with jamming on that for a little while and then I start to feel a little dizzy from the motion, but it's not too bad. I'm trying to get in a couple small jams every day so that I don't lose my chops. Thanks, honey. Best present ever. 
All right, guys, that is Thursday in a nutshell. We are going to end the day with a, a round of pandemic and call Watch it a, your farts over here. <laughs> call it a night. I'm sorry. I, I had really bad gas today, guys, and I swear to you, like I've been watching my diet very closely because I was told not to eat sugar, and obviously that's just a wise decision in Why general. I'm sorry. <laughs> but now, but when I eat sugar or like grains, I just fart a lot. I'm sorry, hon. I don't know why I'm telling you this. This is the end of the vlog. Let's end on a positive note. Um, let's see, what's positive a positive note? note? Um, um, no, can't think of one. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Bye.